Alright, let's do this. What's up everyone? Empowered Q is here bringing you some more League of Legends action. Playing some of that new Aatrox in the top lane. Uh, going for a pretty tanky build here, trying it out. We're going against a Trindomir who we're not going to really want to fight anyway, so... Oh man, that's some nice damage right away. So we want to try and get this big hit that we have that's on the 20 second cooldown against Trindomir because it reduces healing. Uh, which obviously Trindomir has a lot of. So if we can reduce that when we hit him, that'll definitely help uh, win some trades there. Got his flash. Yikes. What are you doing, Trindomir? <laughs> okay. Hold on a second, he's probably back in. Hmm. Might get him. Almost. Nope. Worth a sh shot. So yeah. Um, so yeah, every 25-ish seconds, you can do a big hit that's going to reduce healing and shielding. Good against Trindomir. It's also going to do extra damage, and it gets its cooldown re reduced based on um, you hitting your, your abilities. So I think he's honestly going to really, really disrespect my damage. And that's what's going to help us win lane. So yeah. Um, probably going to go Tiamat into Black Cleaver. And then Sterics or Spear Visage is what I'm thinking for build. Get some cooldown reduction. Get this to make sure this is shoved in. I can go and grab this right over here. Who's the jungler? Wukong. Not too worried about that. Good job, Zed. I got knock-up, so that's really good against the Scuttle Crab. I don't know if that hits Scuttle Crab. Nice! So that's his W right there. It kind of locks him in. So that's really good for Scuttle Crab. And then his E is what gives him healing on his damage dealt. Get that. Come back top. Perfect. I'm just going to let this shove back in. I could just farm with my Q. If he spins in, I'll hit him with my final hit. Change direction for the spin. Perfect. Want to try and get grass procs into. Nice little knock up there. Nice little hit. He should be stuck in here. Nice. Perfect. I'm getting some really juicy trades in on him. So he tried to heal and he got reduced, so. So I'm really winning these trades, I feel like. Easy peasy. -ish. Wow. This trend is not good. So yeah, so... Uh, just a little bit more in depth on what his abilities do. What is that? Is So his E is a dash. So you can use it to reposition your Q. Because once you hit Q, you actually can't move. So it kind of sticks there. So watch, I hit this and then I can move. So you, that's how you want to use it. Uh, so really, I think what you want to do is when someone blows their dash, or Trindomir dashes towards me, I want to hit them with W, and then kind of keep them in position um, with my Qs. And then your Qs actually do bonus damage to minions, so happy day. And then his Blood Well, where he actually revives, is tied into his ultimate. So kind of like Trindomir... My ultimate is kind of my bread and butter for the big fights, if you will. So I'm never really going to want to do an all-in trade against Trindomir without my ultimate. Um, it's going to give me movement speed, increase my attack damage, and then do this blood well thing. If you die slash your health goes away while doing the blood well, um, you can move around while reviving, which is pretty cool. So I'm going to grab my Tiamat, a pair of boots, and a refillable pot. So you can... 
weave Tiamat into your Qs, which is really nice. It kind of serves as an auto attack reset. I assume Trindomir is also going to go Tiamat, so that's going to help me with my wave clear. Kicking his butt in CS, so not too bad. Not too bad at all. Really not bad at all, too, for a lane that has Ignite and I don't. So, really, really happy with how that's going so far. Uh, he hasn't gotten any jungle pressure, though, which is good for me, because I think if Wukong kind of CC chains me... Get out of that. I'm fine with that. I'll heal up. Not a big deal. Got my big hit. Oh, now nah, that's my big hit. I hate it when I have to use that on a minion. Okay, want to fight him before his rage gets too high. So he used all of his rage, so that's good for me. So nice. Just gonna back away here. Yeah, I like the uh, the whole resolve tree. I think that helps me be super tanky and hard to force out a lane. Like, look at where my health is already. I have TP off if they're going to make a big play. I just don't think he wants to fight me. So I'm going to push this in because it's going to push anyways. Just get that on cooldown. Yep. Well, Twitch is doing well. Backline ones. Perfect. Push that in. Trinomir's going to miss that whole wave. Okay, he's finally back. Same deal. I can run back here and grab the uh, Scuttle Crab. Maybe. Oh, there you are. Get it knocked up. See, push it back in. And reposition. Boom. Take that nice and fast. I think Aatrox might actually be a really good jungler. Yeah, so he bought uh, Tiamat like I thought he would. Okay. Got a little nice little knock back there. Pop my other potion. If he walks up for a hit, I can knock him up. Nope. Good. Knocked up. Just walk away. Fade out his ultimate. Now he's gonna back. Okay. Fine with that. Force him out of lane. His ultimate, I think, is more valuable than mine. Sweet. Good job, Twitch. I didn't get the assist. Lame. These guys are all worried about my Aatrox. Oh, there's Wukong. I'm gonna just go back and buy. I have enough gold. Yeah, 56 to 85. Up a kill. I'll take that. Um, then I'm gonna get my... Can I do both? No, can't math. I'm gonna go Phage into a control ward. That's gonna give me the extra movement speed when I kill a minion too. Yeah, I don't think I kill the Trindomir practically ever, honestly, because his ultimate and his disengage, but I'm really able to deny him. So I'll take that. Keep building a CS lead. So if I bait on his ultimate, Twitch could just come up and kill him. What do you grab? You grab boot, send a dagger. Hmm. Definitely probably going to go Ninja Tabby this game. So he has no alts. Yeah. Got it. Nice big hit there. If he spins towards me, I just W him. Okay. Nice. Yeah, so right now this is doing, look at that, 11.76% of targets max health and inflicts Mutilator, which uh, decreases healing on, well, it decreases healing and shields. So that's really good against like ADCs and stuff like that too in a shielding kind of meta. Pretty similar to Aurelia. I missed it. 
All right. Don't know where Wukong is, so I gotta be careful. It's 12 to 2. Oh my god. Got a nice big hit there. Pop him back in. Nice damage. He has to spin out. Yeah, I think once uh, you get used to his attack patterns, it actually feels really solid. I tried this with Conqueror earlier, and I just honestly didn't like it. I feel like the uh, um, Grass feels a, not, a lot nicer. He already has enough damage, so I think tankiness is where to go. All right, buddy, spin at me. Please. Please. Okay. Nice. Ah, oh, almost had him. So, yeah, you want to use your E to reposition. Aatrox also did get hot buffed. Cool. Gonna come rotate, I think. Might look to get... Rift Herald here soon. He has ultimate still. Ah, uh, missed it. Alright. Nice. Oh. They come in, I'll use my ultimate. Nice little whack there. <laughs> yeah. Push us in. I could use my ultimate for the dive, but I think he has ultimate, so I don't really think it's going to be effective. Nice big hits. I like Trinimir, I have enough healing where I'm not too worried about it. Ooh. I'm just gonna die, that's fine. I can walk away. He doesn't have ultimate now. Good with that. Twitch can kill him. I fucked that up. Oh god, I'm gonna die. No! I'll take it, that's fine. Then you get this turret, and I'll get my Black Cleaver and build towards my Ninja Tabby. Not bad. We could, that's the thing I like about this matchup, I think, is we can trade alts for alts. He can't all in me. I can't all him. So it's a nice, healthy little farming matchup that I think I... I don't know if I win it in the end or not, but I feel pretty good about it. Yikes. That was not so good. But yeah, up 35 CS. I'll take that. Getting pretty tanky, too, because, yeah, we're getting 22.5% of physical damage healed, which is insane. So, up to 12.24. So, yeah, imagine if you're going against, uh... It stinks because there's not very many tanky champs in the meta, like, super tanky. But imagine if you're going against a Mundo. You hit this for 12% of their health, plus reduced healing. I think that's going to be super powerful once tanks are back in the meta. So, I really think Aatrox is probably going to be, like, a tank killer champion. But we'll see. And then, so I did go for Emax because it reduces the cooldown on that. That's probably more valuable than the W cooldown. I'm only using W on, uh, like, really big engages. Just gonna head this way. I don't know if Red's out. Ooh. Hello. Hmm. Ooh, that's not good. I'm just gonna teleport down here. Get this wave. Damn, didn't get that one. That's okay. Got that wave pushed. Awkward use of teleport, but uh, I'll be able to fight Tridimir with my ult up. Nice. Swain putting in some work. I can start walking this way. No. We're good. Take away jungle camp. 
Yeah, look at that. They increased the range on his W2, so I don't know how much that impacts. Nice. Walk away there. I see Trindamir. Keep pushing this in. Move that up. Nice. And... Cool. I see Trindamir, so I'm going to get some more tower pressure. Oh, hello. I don't know if I can all enter. Shall we try? Damn. Well, she didn't do, like, any damage to me. I thought I casted my W. I did not. So that's my mistake. Oh, God. The slow. It's real. Make it stop. Papa. Oh, God. So many friends. Nope. I'm out of here. See you later. Whoo, baby. <laughs> You'll probably pop that. Oh, what am I doing? Bam. There we go. Uh, wait for a little bit of gold to grab another ruby curse. So I'm going to go Sterix Gage next. So I'm going to go Sterix into Spear Visage. Cooldown reduction is going to be super, super good on Aatrox because of his, honestly, pretty high cooldowns so that will work out well just like that yeah Ooh, ouch unfortunate that Ludens proc I think is what killed him so go and collect this big wave hello I'm on my way Pop a potion. Nice. Let's get this rip herald. Let Trinomir get away. Not a big deal. Swain putting in work. What is he? 5 0 and 6. Holy moly. What? Little shit. Get back here. Come on, Shelly. That healing is insane. You can also go Death Stance. I think Death Stance would be a good item on him. That could be your last 10% of cooldown right there, too. Oh, now I'm reviving. I want to walk over here. Hey! Twitch. Got uh, speed up. Missed that. Damn. Damn. I don't think I could catch him. Nope. Well, I got a nice stun on all of them, so I'll take it. Fake one. What do you want me to do? I can't catch him. Twitch flashed in. Which flashed into a Wukong with alt. Can't help you there, buddy. Can't help you there. Oh, baby. I don't want to fight into that. That's not something I want to be a part of. They will still wreck me. I'm going to back and grab my Joram's fist here. Perfect. I could sell this. Don't need the extra healing. Just grab the extra health here. Head top lane. I don't think anyone got rift. Hmm. Gonna have my teleport if needed. Do a little dash here. Nice. Is this up? Nice. Should be able to go right here. Bitch. Alright. I just have to die in times. Yep. Perfect. I can walk. 
Yeah! I'll take it. Let's back away. If he runs at me, I can... He should still die. Oh, man, he got away. Vic! That ult lasts so long. Twitch is gonna kill him, though. Bye, Trindamir. He's so dead. Oh, he just spent. He is definitely dead. Do it, Twitch! Bye! I told you, it doesn't matter. He's dead. Woo! She should be dead. Yep. Alright, I'll take that. I'm still up a lot of CS, too. But that's what I mean. I had a feeling that was going to happen once we got to late game that Trendy Mirror could just all end, man. Hmm. Twitch putting in work. ADC's busted and broken and unplayable. <laughs> yeah, no. Let's see. Look at this. Yeah, that, that is crazy. That's a pretty good clear. Good catch top wave. Yep, and I can catch Rift Herald. Top's already pushing, but Shelly there. Someone will need to be there to kind of take care of it, so I can do that. I just love the way he looks. Big hit on Shelly. Zed's going ham for that, uh, Sona. Nice. I mean, it's not gonna kill me. Yep. Gotcha. I don't have ult, so I gotta be careful. Get some healing done. Yeah, look how much. Oh my god. I can't. She's too fast! She's too fast! Got him! Whoo! Gotta go fast. Maybe I should use boy boy uh frozen mallet technology. I went back, Trinivir's up. I can teleport back if need be. I think I can get my sterics, yeah. I'll work on doing my uh spirit visage. Get my cooldown reduction. Nowhere to teleport to. There we go. Never mind. It might be GG. I mean, I think the new Aatrox is fun. You really just gotta get used to his Q, uh, Q animations and the best way to trade with him, and I think he's fun. And I know you can flash uh, his Q so you can get on top of somebody that way. So you can go like this. And then you could go like that, but not miss. I was just showing you guys. Mm, I think I'm dead. Definitely dead. Damn, so much CC. I just couldn't get on top of any of them. Whoopsies! What a stomp of a game, though. Holy hell. I think I really crushed this Trindamir in lane, though. For someone that really usually has a lot of lane pressure, I think it's gone pretty well. Can I sell this for... No, I can't map. I mean, the game is definitely over, though. Both towers down. We can get another hit. Just barren an end. It'll help that the rest of my team went really, really well. 
rest of my team played really, really well. Holy English. Twitch is looking for it. <laughs> mm, about that. Like, he looks sweet. Look at that. Like, aesthetically, he looks awesome. Alright. So, yeah, you can charge... You can hold two charges to your dash if you know how to speak. Should be final team fight here pretty soon. Gotta be careful of the Wukong. As long as we're not wombo combo, it should be pretty easy. I can dash over walls, which is really nice. Too bad. Not bad. As long as you get on the squishies, I think that went really well. Like I said, I don't know. I like new Aatrox. I think it's pretty fun. And I don't think it's, it's... Nobody knows how to play against him yet. So you can use that to your advantage. I've tried Conqueror before. I think he has enough damage. I think uh, Grasp of the Undying feels a lot better on him. Uh, you all cried in rage. I don't think Bran cried. So. Ooh. Got some tokens. So let us see. A plus, not bad. Died one or two times more than I would have liked to. Not bad on damage either. I out damaged Zed, which is hilarious. Huh. Hilarious. Well, let me uh show you guys the runes again real quick. So full tank. Uh grasp of the end dying. Lots of healing done. Gives you a lot of survivability in lane. Bone plating. Second wind for more healing. Revitalize helps out your healing. And then I did Ravenous Hunter and Taste of Blood to make it really, really hard to force me out of lane, which you saw worked really well, especially against the Trindomir with Ignite, of all things. Well, I hope you guys like that one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good jazz. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.